Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to use Canva website template in your WordPress uh, in 2024. So in this video, we'll guide you through the steps to create a beautiful website in Canva and integrate it or export it to your WordPress site. So make sure to stick by and follow this step-by-step -step guide that's going to show you how to use your Canva website in WordPress and let's get started before we start with this video make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have full experience first you'll need to go and open a browser for me here i'm using brave for you you can use this where you want once you open your browser basically just go to the crl section and you'll need to open both your canva websites so canva.com and also your wordpress for me i'll open also my local host where i have my wordpress like hosted and of course, make sure to log in into your account, all of them. So let's say, for example, it's your first time, basically. You'll be taken to those pages. Uh, so here in Canva, you'll have to click on login to log in into your account or click on sign up to sign up into a new account if you don't have an account. As you can see in here, you can use Google, Apple, Facebook, Microsoft, Cleaver if you don't want to get through all the boring steps of entering your information. So log in or even create your account. Same will be for WordPress. As you can see, you'll find yourself here. Click on login to log in into your account or click on create your account. For creating your account, you'll be able to use just Google, Apple, and the up and for login in you'll be able to use all of those basically with the email and login via app if you have the app uh, once you're logged in or you just created your account you'll find yourself in both these uh, pages right here as you can see so in canva first of all you would like to have a website that's already created or template that's already created if not already you can simply just go to the top like right option and click on create design just type here uh, websites so websites right here and click on this website right here and make sure basically here to create your template you can even choose one of the templates or one of the free templates that's available in here make sure it's not pro because you'll not be able to use uh, unless you upgrade your plan so you can use here a lot of templates that are free and you should be good to go after that of course for me here i'll just use one of the templates that i already have as an example which is this one as an example of course i can click on edit design and edit whatever i want on this and of course as we said you will have to uh, go and edit whatever you want on your website before trying to export it wherever you want so once you have your templates ready as we said you can edit the text image colors if you like choose just a template from here as i did uh, you can edit whatever you want on it and of course after customizing your, your website templates it's time to export it so make sure to click on share the top right corner example in here once you click on it you'll find options here so make sure to go and click on download right away in here and of course we would like to choose to download it as a pdf a pdf standards as example why if we choose to download this as pdf senders of course our buttons will keep working and of course from here make sure to select all the pages that you want to export maybe you don't want to export all the pages maybe as an example i don't want this one and yeah so all you need to do here is simply clicking on download and make sure that's your videos audios and animations once play when exported as the type of file of course you can try to download this as mp4 if you want as an example to export any videos so some people will say maybe i have videos i have animations so how can i export it then so what you'll need to do then simply just upload the pages that has no animations just just has buttons maybe it's just this one so make sure to upload or to export those as pdf uh, of course you can simply just maybe i have these uh, page the only one that has a button and that's maybe it has no animation so i'll just go and download it as a pdf alone of course after that i'll have to upload or download the rest so for example i'll just go and delete that and download the rest and i should download it as an mp4 or as an example like as svg which is uh, best for design animation but as you can see i'll not be able to download this for me because i don't have or i don't use the pro plan if you want to use the pro plan of course you can have a like uh, a month for free so make sure to use it especially if you're trying to export this once in your lifetime so you your month for free will be uh, very good so for example if we go here to canva if we go to plans and pricing uh, we'll find an example in the pro plan so start your free trial example you will get as you can see a 30 days free trial and you can cancel it anytime as simple as that so as we said 
so basically here uh, basically uh, once we download everything we should have the files so for me i'll just download everything into pdf sender i'll download all the pages uh, i have just animation uh, like some animation here in like page four but okay let's here so in this page for example it's a video for me and i have some animations so it's with the buttons and etc so yeah it will not be exported like correctly but it's fine so I'll just as we said i will go here to download pdf standards and remove that page and of course make sure to not check this option because it will as you can see convert everything into one single image per page and yeah and this notes of course if you want to include any notes that you have you can simply save those download settings so you can always like exports it like that then simply just go here and click on download of course once it's downloaded you will have to go and conf convert those pdf into html for so example here once it's downloaded i'll just go and save it wherever and as we said uh, like once you download those things uh, you will have of course to use the canva design in your wordpress but to use it on wordpress you'll need to convert this pdf of course into xml there are uh, several online tools available for this purpose as an example such i'll just open a new tab just type uh, as an example here pdf to h so sorry to html as simple as that there's a lot of converters some of them are free some of them are paid so make sure as an example to choose free ones maybe this one as an example and uh, of course you can choose for you other things maybe you will not like this or whatever you want it's up to you then basically you'll have to upload your pdf file to one of these tools and download the converted html file for example here select a file and i'll just go to download this one as an example make sure to click on convert and it should be converted into html once it's uh, of course downloaded we'll need to go to wordpress go to this last panel and go and click on plugins for me i don't know why my local host didn't open because it has like a plan on it so i can use like the plugins for me here in the free plan you cannot use plugins so make sure just for you to go to plugins and install a wordpress plugin for uh, for custom like html you'll need a plugin that allows you to add custom html to your pages search for plugin like insert html snipped or HTML import to and install and activate the plugin the one that you choose it's up to you then of course you can just go to pages uh, so for me I don't have pages here or basically it's actually here but I will not be able to add a new page but of course just go for you and click on add a new page and basically just use that plugin add your HTML code to your WordPress site of course you will say which HTML code the HTML code that this will give you as you can see the HTML code will be ready so I'll just go here and click on download click on save and of course you can always just open it and as you can see uh, the design might look off a little bit but of course you'll be able to make a lot of fix on it you'll be able to fix it let's see if those buttons are still working as an example yeah it seems like the buttons are still working uh, this should like take me to the home page it seems like it's not working but as you can see it did not convert it well but it's the best that it can do maybe you can try another uh, like websites or uh, online tool that will make maybe a better work so yeah i guess that's gonna be it for me today thank you for watching and i'll catch you in the next video so goodbye